What's up, everybody? Here's another YouTube video of my 1961 Plymouth Fury. One of the last years of the Virgil Exeter Creations. I decided to take it out for a little spin today. What's it? It needs to be driven. Um, just doing a little video here of the car, and um, get, I'm getting ready to wash it. And maybe I'll take some pictures of it. This is a video of the 61. I'm going to show you what I'm doing right here. Oops. Got to roll my window up a little bit more. I don't want no water to get inside my interior. Yeah. There we go. This is my dash right here, my steering wheel. Oh, I forgot my air freshener for this car. I like my car smelling nice inside, but not because I didn't have the extra cash for it today. I also noticed some um, gas went back up a little bit. It's a good thing I filled this car up the other day when I did. No, I don't burn that cheapy gas in it either. I burned that good high test. I burned high test in it. Well. I do have a bottle of ethanol treatment in the trunk in case I need it. And I also put marble mystery oil in it too. In the tank of the gas, in the fuel tank, not in the engine. I'll probably do that before the oil change and clean out the engine a little bit some. But I don't know if I should do that. But I learned one thing. When I worked at a gas station called Texaco, this is what I learned. If you use a gasoline with no or very little detergent additives, you are decreasing the life of your engine. I figured I'd pass that to some people and the classic car owners, so like I said, just keep a bottle of ethanol treatment in the trunk of that car in case you need it. Um, there's another front end shot of it. So if you hear me flapping my jaws, I might add some music to this video from YouTube. Wish I could add some tunes from the year 1961, but they don't have that because of that copyright thing. Like... Because sometimes the music, when I'm doing a video at a car show, there'll be music playing in the background, and that's not me. I'm not playing that music. Um, let's walk around here a little bit more. Yep. One little Fury emblem right there. My tires. When I bought the car, the, the had tires on it like that were pretty old, so they were had a lot of tread on them. But I said, well, I'm not taking any chances with these with these tires. I will be also be doing a video at um, Tennessee Valley Mopars, but their new location was it's at Monte Sano State Park in Huntsville, Alabama. And if um, any fellow forward lookers is watching this video, I hope to be I hope to compete against another 61 Plymouth. And also, I like to have our cars parked next to each other. Um. Well, um, well, just doing another round of video. Yep. We'll open up the passenger side of the car. Yep. 
Yep, in there. That's my stuff I'm not take inside the house yet. I know I got my windows tinted, but I didn't go very dark. This is lighter lighter than lighter than ten in my last sixty one. It's only like 30, 50 percent right here is what I did. Sometimes I see some sparse parts of this car on eBay. I put them on my watch list. Sometimes I, these things cost a pretty penny. I said, well, if I don't have the cash for it, I won't get it. I'll kill Sam my watch list until I'm able to afford it. Look in the mansion. It's my... Poly 318. I got a power brake booster from the later model car. It'll be easier for me to um, check the um, brake fluid. My uh, power brake booster was like making a vacuum noise. Like it was like leaking or something like that. So I said, I thought it would cost me like a pretty penny to get that rebuilt. And I said, well, I might as well put a later model power brake booster on it. Right here, there's nothing here. Is my electronic ignitions right there? That'll save me points. All this stickers right here. Yep. Put down this stick from another battery. Um, here's this stuff out of clean, the original clean. So that works right there. Oh, that is still pretty clean. Yeah, I can clean right there because I'm. Using no, use that cheapy, cheap no name brand gas. My new pad, hood pad, because my um my original one was no good, couldn't be saved. the heck there's some paint on there and how that happened I don't know okay close the hood down I'm going to end this video right here. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell for future videos, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching, and God bless.